What the shit? Specifically, just killed your character? No. So how you kill this guy is you go to you go around get these ballistas and shoot him in the arms. And you, after, when you shoot the first one, he smashes it. And so I'm like, you're standing on the literally like right next to it. So I'm like, I was like, what if what if that just killed me? <laughs> Abraham, we're lucky too. guy, I guess he was one of the saviors in The Walking Dead, and he like showed up to uh, Alexandria, and uh, Rick, um, Kill no, Rick was like, he showed up, he was like, taunting him or something, and he was like, I guess Abraham and Gwen were lucky then, and uh, oh, I, I saw that, yeah, okay, yeah, and he like stops and he just like <laughs> immediate he's like you say anything like that to me again I'll break your jaw break your teeth you understand? just so cold as Rick tends to be oh, fuck you dude I like the officer friendly vibe he had in the first two seasons, like when, before he went completely crazy. Yeah, I like him crazy. When he's when he's like fucking insane like that, it makes him so badass. <laughs> yeah. Alright. Damn it, he got away. Okay, whatever, I'll come back for him. But it's it's very clear that Shane was kind of the one that broke him over that edge. Yep. Alright, time to kill this asshole with my dragon bone smasher. Alright, you've been really fucking annoying, so you're gonna die. And you know the like original concept behind that scene? What was it? That Wait, hold on, hold on. Wait to finish your thought. Let me uh kill this guy first. It won't take that long. Alright. Oh that voice saw him! Ah! Yeah, 
out of here, bitch. Get the fuck out of here. Dragon God Slain. And I got his... Uh, Dragon Demon Soul. Paint the soul of an arch demon, the right color is fog shell, I'll press you no more. Alright, cool. Alright, that's it. You, you can go ahead and take your draw. The 